Astra Generation J has a pleasant appearance, good equipment, and a reasonable price. Generation J Asters, 2010 to 2015, for the Russian market were assembled at the GM plant in Shushery. The sedan appeared only in 2012 along with restyling, so hatchbacks are the majority of cars sold. There are even more station wagons on the secondary market than sedans. The GTC and OPC versions have more powerful engines and sportier suspension. Prosperous aspirated 1.4, 90 horsepower, 1.6, 115 horsepower, and 1.8, 140 horsepower, were tested on the previous Astra N. They live up to 400,000, despite minor weaknesses. Turbo engines 1.4, 140 horsepower, and 1.6, 180 horsepower, are made from atmospheric and are close to them in terms of the mechanical part. Turbines are simple and run 150 to 200,000 kilometers. However, the atmospheric legacy has not gone away in the form of current heat exchangers, capricious phase regulator valves, unsuccessful pre-styling thermostats, sometimes they put more reliable ones from the Chevrolet Cruze, and a quickly polluted intake manifold. To this is added the low resource of the chain, by 1.4, and the belt, by 1.6, of the timing drive. The motor 1.4 is more successful, it is less thermally loaded. The 180 horsepower A16 LED engine has a more difficult character due to the insufficient performance of the cooling system, the fourth cylinder suffers especially. The more modern 1.6 CD turbo engine, A16 XHT, 170 horsepower, is also not simple. In the early versions, the electrodes of the candles often fell off and the pistons cracked, due to poorly selected material and the rapid formation of soot. The chain could stretch up to 50,000 kilometers. The motor was cured by 2015, but soon Opel left Russia. When choosing a runaway 1.6 turbo engine, diagnostics with compression measurement are recommended. AI A92 a gasoline in all turbo engines causes detonation and accelerates the formation of deposits. But with good care, a mileage of 250,000 kilometers is not the limit for them. There are few cars with turbo diesels. They have all the features of modern turbo diesels, first of all, two delicate fuel equipment. Transmission. The ancient mechanical 5-step F17 works with all aspirated. Its disadvantages are weak differential and output shaft bearings. The higher the torque, the faster the wear. The 6-speed M32WR box is friends with turbo engines. The problems are similar, but it is stronger and lives longer. Jim's machine 6T30, 6T40 and 6T45 for motors with different torque, are structurally similar. The valve body is about the same for everyone, it does not tolerate aggressive driving style and peak loads, sometimes a bulkhead is required by 100,000 kilometers. A common sore is leaks in the working fluid cooler hoses. An oil change is desirable, although the manufacturer does not require it, even for manual transmissions, every 40 to 50,000 kilometers and for automatic transmissions it is better to reduce the interval to 25 to 30,000 kilometers. With a careful attitude, all of them are able to live up to 300,000 kilometers. When driving on bad roads, get ready to change the steering tips, struts and stabilizer support bearings frequently. In cold weather, the suspension can tap, shock absorber struts and brake calipers make extraneous sounds. Replacing wiper blades requires switching to service mode, read the instruction manual. Indicators screaming about malfunctions are often a hint of snot in the onboard network. It can help, for example, tightening the nut of the mass wire. 